Hey fuckers, what's up? It's Light Yagami. I'll teach you how to glitch in AOT2 and how to become walking colossal titans. But hold on first, I need to deal with a rotten criminal who's an actual offender. This shithead deserves to die. You'll see what I mean. In the world we live in now, I've been maintaining order. I have become justice. The only hope for AOT2 players is me. The cacks all deserve to die. Since my appearance six months ago, CACs have stopped ending missions early, and global crime rates have been reduced by over 70%. But it's not enough. This world is still rotten. We still have CACs like... like... him. first got the death note all those years ago, I knew it had to be me. I had to do it. I understood that killing the Cax and the Esh Haze was a crime. There was no other way around it. The world had to be fixed. The purpose was given to me. I am the god of the new world. Who else could have done it and come this far? The only one who can create a new world is me. This Cack will be the first to die. Fendir Pablo. This disgusting demon doesn't deserve to live to see the light of day. I'll write his name in the death note. Pablo the Molester. I shall sentence you to death by extreme panic and heart attack. feeling pretty hungry after that speech. Maybe I should head over to McDonald's and bring Armin with me too. We should hang out at the movies later. Hi, welcome to McDonald's. How can I help you? Hi. Give us a sec, would you? What about you, Armin? What do I want? Mm. Maybe a Big Mac? Mm. Nah, I don't want that. Well, whatever you want, you better decide fast. We have to get to the movie soon. All right, fine. I'll take a double quarter pounder with no salt, easy on the mustard with a pinch of mayo, three slices of onion, ten apple slices, and a large water with no ice. What about you, sir? What are you going for? Yeah, can we get four Happy Meals, two ice waters with no H2O, dry bread with no gluten, and some boneless pizza? What did you think of that movie? Sheesh. That long-haired, bony titan was pretty scary. If I knew his name, I'd write it down in my death note. Shh. 
What's that sound? Do you hear that? That sound. It's getting closer and closer. Don't worry, it's probably just some crackheads. I'll check outside the window. Armin, look, that bony son of a bitch was real. Oh, fuck, it's the AOT2, AOT2 crashing Titan. I'm getting the fuck out of here, Light. vile fuck of a cack. The Eshes. Koei. They're all rotten. You see what's happening before you? This... This is the present AOT2. Enjoy it, you cacks. I hope you're happy, Sai. You let people like Pablo, the disgusting fuckwad, taint the game. Fuck it all, you beltweight pansies, Koei. All of you developers. Your names. I'll write them down. Is this what you wanted, Koei? After I cleanse the game of filth, you can't treat me like this. The Crashing Titan! It's come for me! Help! Armin! Maybe the... Ryuka! No way. It can't be. This is what's happening to Attack on Titan 2. How could they possibly let it get this bad? It has essentially cut the player base into half after half after half. Though, I should be fine. I have the best hardware, that's a relief. God damn. That just means I can't play with other people. It's turning into Wings of Freedom. An empty landscape, just me and nostalgia left to rot. AOT3 will make things better. I think... Fuck. I'm lying to myself in my own thoughts. The hell... It won't get better. May as well demonstrate the glitch already since they disconnected. Give me a second. I want to look cool just a little longer. Right, bitches. Book boy disconnected for his shoddy last-gen cheap hardware. I'll take over till he returns. The new generation stuff really tramples on the old. Koei has either abandoned the last generation of souls, or has spent all efforts on fixing that damn candle. Light insisted on revealing the secret to the colossal titan glitch. I won't repeat the steps on how to do this, so you either focus or get lost and don't ask for help in the comments. I won't be responding. Well, right to it then. 
Pick either of the Colossus Titan users and get your sorry ass into a mission with a minimum of two total players. You cannot see yourself as the Colossal, but others should be able to if done accordingly. Alright, you cute lot. First head to an area at the border of the map that forces your character out of the play zone. The easiest being rivers and fences. Oops, my bad. I forgot. You'll need either Aaron, Reiner, Annie, or Ymir as buddy action comrades. Fucking hit the transformation when situated outside the play area. You should be sent back to the play area for a split second, then shit and quickly use the buddy action titans to cancel your original attempt to transform. And just watch the godforsaken footage. This is what the other player should see me as after I ace this shit. My best bud, Laney Wakura, does this Wabajack first try. No kidding. Fine. Fuck off. Don't believe me. Here is some additional intel for you. Be grateful I honestly could not be bothered to go further, but fuck me, here I am. I'll speedrun this Dingleberry, so get ready. Armin does not have the walking animation that Bert Roloto, whatever the fuck his name is, has. Armin does not have the death animation, but hey, he can do the glitch without the need for borders and still crap in T-pose if you give a damn. Oh yeah, um, the walking is randomized, ha 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 ha. Enjoy some of this shit, CIA losers. You've been appearing more now that more people have been playing AOT2. The new glitches. It made me recall what I was not meant to forget. A grand dream. I was dead until that book boy made great claims for change. Is he coming back to be rid of the SHAs and CACs? I genuinely doubt he had it in him. Not even the blonde kid with him took him seriously. Another inferiority complex with the guise of a messiah. So... What is it that you really want? I want Falconia. I mean, AOT3 is my... I mean our kingdom to do as we please, as we wish and dream. To have the reins on altering the maps, creating maps, removing the preposterous wait times for scripting sequences to be rid of the side missions. It is my dream. I once told a comrade of mine, to become my friend, he must be my equal, someone worth having at my side. Is it possible to attain my dream with such a falsification of the leaderboards, skill systems, gear handouts? The legitimacy of being good at this game is utterly bullshit as of recent. I find it simply abhorrent to live out my life without glitching, for that is my sole reason for being. My dream for the new AOT3 is a great storm, blowing hundreds and thousands of dreams apart in their wake. So your dream is this colossal storm of changes and wishful thinking. I suppose if a technological feat is possible, man will do it. Almost as if it's wired into the core of our being. What you're saying is, the current state of AOT2 makes you feel confined. Your only freedom lies within the current boundaries of the game's existence. It seems you have issues, my friend. Yes. But Koei simply lacked the spark required to burn bright and roar into reality. Have you seen the countless current flaws that hamper and hinder the current state of AOT2? I have all the downloadable additional content to the outfits and extra missions, and now look at what has become of it. How we've been quite frankly snobbed with this twattery. Damn, cool it. 
I wished for cross-platform so the playability is enriched. I'd want that to test myself against the out-of-date lettuce, the Chief and Levi the Boo Boo Cool Man, all in a single game, together. Do you have anyone you'd hope to play with? Yes. I want to join my boy Guts and Zod. God, do I miss them, but it's not just that. The current state of the game is filled with esh A's and cacks. They see nothing more than unskillfully climbing the ranks or only rushing headfirst into red smoke signal bosses. They are dead, for they have no dream. Koei have repulsively left this game with crashes originating from poor console compatibility. Just ask Light and Armin. Leaderboard cheating scum and filth on the PlayStation 4. Zeke and Reiner's outdated models, stale Titan gameplay, lacking slaughters, and instead left bare as a system combat with no substance. I see what you mean. Godspeed to that. Although you are correct, AOT2 is not the same game as it once was at release. I would truly love to see more for AOT3, but I aren't buying if we don't get peak playable with a thousand outfits and Aaron's hardened fists. Not to mention a damn anti-idiot cure to stop Titans spazzing and spiraling out of control mid-air against Thunder Spears. Being a sentient AI, human, cyborg, God thingy wingy, can you perhaps mod my dream into reality? I can sacrifice many things like the hawk. Hell nah, but be quiet for a moment, flower boy. What's that sound? You hear that, right? Oh, holy crap. It's him. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Can't get shit done around here with this crackhead stalking me. Apologies, I must leave early. I left the cooker on. Well, that's all she wrote, folks. I guess Light isn't coming back. Not with his last generation trinket tier hardware. You shiny diamonds, enjoy this montage of the glitch in action. Good night.
If I lose it all, lose it all. If I lose it all.